I have this question from someone who wanted to find out whether I did the anatomy part of the USMLE from the 100 concepts of anatomy, which is the shelf notes, or I use other resources like the Grace Anatomy or the Atlas. So to answer your question, um, what I did during my step one days was um, I took part of two days. Um, to do the 100 concepts. So I did half in one evening, then the next evening I did the other half. But what I did was that I made notes from it and also I used some landmarks on my body to be able to uh, remember them. So that is where I did my anatomy basically from. Um, if you have a lot of time, you can use other resources. But what I will advise is that when you do the 100 concept, like try to do it like, early in your studies so that you can apply them on the questions on your world over time so that like by the time you're ready for the exam you will, you would be able to like um, get used to uh, how to pick your answers so try to do it as early as possible so that you can apply it on you well don't wait until the last minute there are some people who tell you oh you can wait like maybe one week to the exam then you do your hundred concept but i would advise you doing it early so that you can apply that knowledge on you world questions and get very familiar with and um, the application of the knowledge also i use um, some landmarks on my body and that makes me remember stuff like if i talk of the ulnar um, nerve on this side the median nerve um passing passing this side you know or the radial nerve like try to like position everything that you study from there on your own um body right so that you can easily uh remember um the, the stuff you know so th th this this is what i did and um, the other resource that i use for anatomy is from the first aid so this first aid is very important the first aid book very very important so i try to like correlate you world um, images the first aid and then the hundred concepts of anatomy those are the only three resources that i use for anatomy and um anatomy was one of my good areas when i was taking the usmle step one so um to conclude this video i'm just going to leave you with a simple mnemonic for the ulna and then the median nerve motor functions so for the ulna nerve we all know that it goes this way on this part of the arm this way right we know it goes this way uh, if i want to place my arm well the ulnar nerve will travel this way and what it is doing is that it wants to help innovate the hypoternal muscles here and this the function of this hypoternal muscle and the ulnar nerve is to do the above the functions i summarize them called above that is abduction of the little finger so above of the little finger abduction of the little finger opposition of the little finger and also flexion of the little finger so that is above also for the median nerve as it goes it also does above of the thumb right so that's a simple function above of the thumb by innervating these thinner muscles and so abduction abduction of the of the thumb opposition of the thumb and also flexion of the thumb that would be the median nerve then they all have sensory functions where the median nerve will innervate this first um this one from here so this is my first second third fourth so half of the third up to this side sensory then from here the other nerve can uh, take um, the rest so uh, basically um, this is the um, answer to your question. I hope you learned something from this video. Good luck in your prep, especially good luck in anatomy. You can get easy points from anatomy. I'll see you again in the next video. You can do this. Bye.